The Hottie Beach Police Department 2019 Department Awards, held at the beautiful Waterfront Beach Resort, a Hilton Hotel, and who shared program sponsorship with the California Resources Corporation. Uh, but again, this is a tremendous event. Uh, the Mayor Peterson mentioned that we were 150 people four years ago. And to sit here amongst over 350 today uh, to honor all the folks for the amazing work that they do is just an incredible gesture. And I'm so proud of the Foundation Board to be able to help sponsor this. So thank you again very much. Mayor Eric Peterson, City Council, Administration, Police Officers, Family and Staff was made part of the event that helped recognize deserving professional individuals and units in over 15 awarded categories. You know what really stands out to me is that so many of these employees don't want to be here, they don't want to be recognized. You know, the officer who's up uh, for the Medal of Valor went into a burning building, crawled on the floor uh, to save a woman. I think he was more nervous on stage than when he went into the building. Officer Burchell located the woman in her bed where she was still connected to various medical equipment machines. The extreme heat, smoke, and darkness made the rescue very difficult. Our Burchell, Officer Burchell, with limited visibility, quickly moved around the bed, disconnected the medical equipment, freeing the elderly woman from her bed, and then put the victim on his back, crawled through a smoke-filled room to safety. Wow, you should be getting two of these. <laughs> Among the many honored included Crime Officer Fighter of the Year. Officer Hasselback is commended for his tireless work ethic, DUI expertise, which is not only enhanced the work of his, his fellow officers, but the safety of his community. Congratulations, Officer Hasselback. Crimes Against Persons Unit. Uh, members of this unit continuously balance their efforts in these sensitive cases to provide complete and comprehensive investigations with successful dispositions, two murder investigations, several officer-involved shooting reviews, and solving a 1994 double homicide are just a few examples of the unbelievable work done by this group. Truly, traditions continued into the 2019 ceremony as the Gil Corper Memorial Scholarship and the Jake Olson Scholarship were once again features of the luncheon. Additionally, recognizing the newly established Fallen Officer Program with most recent officer Mark Hansen honored. As always, Tim Conway does a great job helping kind of lighten the mood a little bit. And please stand so everybody can see where you are. Right here. Right there. <laughs> Kupferstein family. Kupferstein. Kupferstein. <clears throat> Remember you cops used to be named Friday? <laughs> By the way, Jake Olson got into USC the old-fashioned way, great. <laughs> it's humbling. It's humbling when you hear just that small snapshot and realize those things are taking place every single day with the men and women out on the street serving the Huntington Beach community. Congratulations and go Huntington Beach. Ding dong with you. Serving the cause above all rest. These are the professionals of the Huntington Beach Police Department. For Surf City Highlights, this is Matt Lifring.